Hello, Ioni here with Eve's Garden Handmade Soaps. Today I'm going to be doing a molding video using my slab mold and my uh, cutting board liner inside. Um, I made up a batch using uh, coconut, palm, olive, canola, castor, and super fatting with African shea butter. And I've already done all that. So I'm scenting with a fruit scent. Um, pear, strawberry, kiwi, um, let's see what else is in it, <coughs> peach, orange, oh, I can't think of all the fruits, but it's very, very lovely scent. Anyway, I've made up six colors, uh, electric bubblegum pink with some titanium dioxide, a uh, peach using coral mica and titanium dioxide, a yellow using a uh, fizzy lemonade, a white using titanium dioxide, a purple using electric bubble gum and um, ultra, uh, electric bubble gum and ultramarine blue, and a light limey green made with fizzy lemonade and chrome green. I'm going to be doing. Um, a Taiwan swirl, chopstick swirl in this slab. So I'm going to be trying to stripe my colors lengthwise here. And I have a plan on how I'm going to do it. Uh, purple's on the outside going into pink. So I'm going to kind of watch this as I go. But these will have a stripe on the outside first. I'm not even sure how big these stripes should be. Probably not too big. So, I've never done this before. I like how I uh, always put my exper experiments on video for you guys to experience right along with me. Messy, messy. Okay, let me just squish this over a little. Into the corner. It didn't want to go completely into the corner there. There we go. Maybe I'll wipe up my mess too. Don't want to get my pretty uh, wood mold all dirty. My friend, uh, my friends Roger and Trudy um, Roger makes these wood molds for me, and he does such a fabulous job. They're just beautiful. And I love them because they gel so nice. The colors always come out so bright and pretty in them. Okay, so there's one on one side. Now let me do one on this side. I think that might be a little too fat. Guess I need my spatula here to stop the running. Okay, so then I was going to go purple, then green. Green, where are you? Here we are. And if I turn it this way, it'll be easier for me. Now that you guys know what I'm doing here. Just going to stripe another one down alongside that purple. I'm going to have to build this up slowly to keep these stripes in order. Otherwise, I would have had to put dividers in all alongside. And since I don't have any that I want to do that with, I'm just going to do it this way. Oops. A little green over into the uh, purple there. I don't imagine it will make that much difference when all is said and done. But how am I going to get all these colors in there? I better squish them together a little bit, I think. Let's get over there a little bit. Oop, they don't want to go. They don't want to stay. It's too loose yet. We'll be thickening up as we go along, though, I'm sure.
Okay, next. What did I have next? Uh, yellow. Okay, yellow. Okay, wish me luck here. It was thin and now it's thick. Just get that fixed a little. Okay. Oops, I didn't do my other one. Hold on. Hold the phone. There we go. Okay, and the next color is electric. Let's see. No, let's see. Uh, peach. Peach, peach, peach. Oops. Stop, stop. <laughs> done it before, but I like it. Even it up a little so they look more like stripes. And one more here. Looks like these are way too big though. <laughs> Might have to thin them down a little bit on my next few passes. Okay, I'm going to uh, check my camera so you might see a little uh, blink going on here. Just want to don't go over, I don't want to go over the time allot allotment. Okay, next color is white. Got a little gloppy. Alrighty. And then it's like two rows of pink, so they can just be one fat one in the middle there, I guess. You know, let me uh, even those out a little. Oops. Over there, you. All righty. So it's like making two passes with the pink. 
Let me just even that out a bit too. Okay. Make sure all the corners and uh, edges are clean. Looks like they are. So I'm going to make more passes and I'm going to keep doing this until the mold is full. So I'll relieve you guys until that point. Okay, I filled this up. It took a long time and the soap got very hard. It's technically <laughs> too hard to do a chopstick swirl through. Um, it's going to leave a high low impression on the top for sure and uh, that could be planed off or it could end up looking pretty I don't know but I'm going to give it a shot wish me luck that I don't ruin this whole batch of beautifully colored soap so here we go looks pretty cool to make a true Taiwan swirl you're supposed to go the other way as well but I am NOT going to press my luck here I'm going to leave it like this I need to pound it down because I've got several air holes going through there that I can see and then I'll cover it up and gel it and see what we end up with okay everybody keep your fingers crossed thank you for watching bye well, I'm back again <laughs> after I said goodbye, but I found my courage and took the uh, chopstick the other direction as well. And I think it does look a lot prettier that way. I pounded out a lot of air bubbles, so this is what the final slab looks like. And uh, I hope those colors pop after gelling. I hope the titanium dioxide isn't going to crackle or anything. That's always a worry when using titanium dioxide with colors. Anyway, thanks again and uh, keep your fingers crossed. I'll post some pictures when it's all cut. Bye!